Yo, what is up everybody? It is your boy Sans Swiss and in this video, I will just be giving you guys my thoughts on some inf crazy information that I found out today. Um, I know I'm kind of late on it, but it is the Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm 4 DLC, which will be released in February. It is called Road to Boruto. Um, I know a lot of people are excited about this. I, for one, am very excited because I am a huge Naruto fan. I have been watching it for a very long time. Um, I really don't keep up with the manga because I know it ended, but I know Boruto is still going. But I know the manga right now is just an adaptation of the movies. Um, I think the last Naruto it's called and um, Boruto. I know it's just an adaptation to that. And a lot of people are bashing the manga because of the animations that are going on right now. Um, like I said, I don't keep up with that. But so yeah, um, let's get into it. So first of all. I am very surprised that they are making this a, well I'm not really surprised because it was bound to happen because with the amount of like concept to Boruto right now they don't have enough to make a whole game and it makes sense to produce a DLC. Now this is kind of good and bad because if they release this it's going to be a hard copy and a digital download for you know people to get and there's already been confirmation not really confirmation just um like speculation that they are making a naruto storm remastered collection for the ps4 i think it's gonna happen it should happen because you know next gen storm would be crazy you know those games i grew up on those games on ps3 and i know a lot of people did and I know a lot of people love to see that and um so yeah, I know that with this coming out, I think that um, Storm Remastered will come out in two years, 2018, not 2017, and that's a long time to wait. I'm pretty sure they're already working on it, but back to Boruto. Now, for it to be a standalone DLC, they're going to have to push a lot of content, and I say that because this is the first time uh, that I remember where Naruto Storm has has came out and a year later produced DLC for it like that doesn't happen because usually around that time a year after the game was released they release another game so you have to think that this DLC is gonna pump a lot of content into the game now content wise I mean movie storyline that will be really cool which it will have it will have that um, a bunch of characters because I don't have it here but if you go to the character selection there's a lot of empty empty slot empty slots and I don't know if they're gonna fill those up or not but it'll be really cool to see that happen because I know a lot of people characters in the, in the show have kids and you know that would be really cool to be able to play as them for once before Boruto actually gets big enough to have its own game so all in all, I'm pretty excited about it. I'm definitely going to get it. Like I said, this is really crazy that a year after Storm 4 has came out, they're just releasing a, a DLC like this for the for the fans, you know. I'm very happy for I'm very happy for them for caring about us. Um, cuz usually they make us wait a year, year and a half for a new game to come out. But like I'm just happy that they're just releasing content to the same game. So people don't have to go spend $60 on a new game for something that would have been short and crappy. Now this DLC is probably going to be $15, $20. You get enough content to live off of until the next Storm game comes out. Even if there is a next Storm game. Um, so yeah, those are my thoughts on the game. Real quick, I'm just going to throw up the scan on the screen. To just like the confirmation that this is happening. So yeah, check this out. The scan shows Boruto. I think her name is Sarada. I'm really I don't like I said I don't keep up with the manga now um, Sasuke and Naruto and honestly I'm gonna sound stupid but for a second I thought Naruto was Obito there is a very good resemblance there to Naruto to Obito it, it's just really weird I really thought it was Obito I think it was just the color and how the picture was taken but yeah so that's the scan it says right there February 2017 now, I don't know if that is Japan, February, or if it's going to be globally or US, NA, released before Japan. Because I think Storm was before Japan, 
and so I would really like I don't want to sound selfish but I would really like to get this first to get my hands on it so I can just show you guys how it is um, so yeah that's everything in the video I just gave you guys my thoughts on it what I like that it's gonna have and what I dislike not really about the game but just like you know the weight on the remastered collection um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did don't forget to drop a like and hit that subscribe button if you're new here I'm going to be pumping out content this week for you guys I know I've said it before but I'm pumping out content that it's hard to believe but I'm going to do it for you guys so yeah drop a like hit the subscribe button if you're new here and as always peace out Girl Scouts